So no changes there. But there was a change in this one. Range is 60. Range is 40. We'll, uh, we'll flip half of these. So we'll do 50-50. And I think this one looks absolutely gorgeous. That's going to be quite difficult to, uh, to memorize all of these things for me. Uh, defensive station, turbo laser. Do we got other layouts? No. Iron cannons. We've got your fighters. Why is it red? Interesting. Well, good to know. It's, uh, it's, it's flying, apparently. Cool name. Why not? It's called flying. Uh, the second fleet is moving, and how expensive would it be to upgrade this one? Actually, not too expensive. Uh, we'll do... We'll keep this the way it is right now, and we'll upgrade this fleet. We'll do one at a time. And there is the third fleet as well, uh, who is all the way over here. It just takes forever to get there, so we'll use the first fleet. Actually, the third fleet to get over there. And we'll, we'll play it cool. We'll play it cool. We'll vassalize him. Let's see. We got more minerals. And let's take a look. Spaceport under attack. Oh, really? No. That's sad. Who else am I fighting? Well, at least not these guys. So he is actually engaging me. That is nice. 6k against a 3.9k station. We'll pro probably flip this one into like hangar base. This is going to be a good fight, lads. Let's uh, see if I can still memorize all of these buttons. Yes, I do. There's the fight going on. There's the fleets. All of these smaller ships are heading over here. Vessels upgraded. And there we go. Vessels have been upgraded on the, um, on the fleet with Darth Vader on it. Oh man. Can't see Jack about it. So damn shame. Uh, let's get new research. Weapon generator. So plus weapon defense. Shield HP or evasion. Hmm. I, I, I'd say... If we build a Death Star, we're definitely somewhat weaponized. So let's go with Weapon Generator while we keep doing the rest. And we'll take... Every vessel increases their tribute by 25. I think the Moth Council is really good for this one. Uh, let's take a look at the stats. Oh, that's so nice. Ships are getting close. Whoa, I think we just uh, won. <laughs> I think we just won. Uh, fully repaired, that's quite nice. And let's wait here. Man, he pulled back really fast. Did not expect that. Let's take a look. So, he's over there. The station itself. It's nothing too interesting. He's, he did pull back. Hmm. Actually, I want you to upgrade first. And we'll start moving with you. Let's go in there. We'll vassalize as many as possible. Kind of hoping that this is not going to be one of those series. You know, where you just keep storming on. Apparently, they're now rivals, which is fine. I love that sound, actually. Where it just lets you know that fight is commencing. This could could be a bit rough. Our uh, ships that we lose will we'll have to replace. Technology secured. Now we got new tech, more research. Um heavy vehicles. Mining stations plus ten. Well, I'll go for the mining plus ten for now, but I want more economy, I want more minerals. I don't like waiting for stuff to happen, so uh, we'll definitely have to deal with that. Let's get everything here. I should not do that when they're fighting, right? People would be upset. Don't want people upset. Uh, we'll get some governors. And we have to get started on research. Even though we already do 300... To, wow. The uh, physical research is really high.
Don't forget armies. Yeah, you're right. I should. Weapon generator. Let's save it for a bit. Colony development speed tracking system. Uh, yes, because tracking system has been a bit on the uh, the lower end. Let's take a look which planets are nearest. I think it's this one. So you. Uh, there's no need to upgrade you just yet. We don't have anyone near anyone else. Let's go armies. Oh, look at that. Stormtroopers. I love those. Absolute cool. Let us uh, recruit stormtroopers. And the A-T-S-T walkers. Shit. Yeah, man. Love that. Uh, the damage is about the same. Doesn't really matter now, does it? Collateral damage is higher. The health is a lot higher. And actually, the the cost, not so much. Let's do 3 on 2. Uh, for now. That's how five, 5 armies will be trained over there. While we take care of this. So, we have alloys. What are you? Why are you trade? This is definitely not a good region to have this station in. Station should be in this region. So we'll build that up. We'll remove him. As for the trade. Mm, we could just build it over a planet. So we can actually help the planet develop. So we'll build one over here. Let's upgrade you. Man, we're getting so much unity. That is just so weird. Subjugation trust cap. Ruler level increases. Why not? Let's take it. What else do we have? Uh, we were building up you, right? So that's 25 days. That will be defensive. You are going to get more. We can actually go for a asteroid miner if we would like. To. I love these orbital factories though. But the base upkeep is 8. We'll have to take a look at the planet and see if that is better. So, base upkeep is 8 for 3 alloys. Where's my alloy production? Let's take a look here. So, 10 for 10. So, we're trading 1 versus 1. So, don't build these on, the, on your star bases. I think it's definitely not worth your time. Definitely need to... Man, it, it, the border gore is absolutely disgusting. This guy needs to die. He's still pathetic. Um, he is as a non-aggression. Yeah, we'll have to do this fast. We'll uh, vassalize him as well. Just make sure that the border doesn't look like... Shh, crap. Mm, and this guy... This guy actually is quite large. He's equivalent. Separatist council, so he's never going to like me. Never going to happen. Drink. Yes, sir, I will. <sighs> there you go. Let's on pause. Let's take a look how this fight is actually progressing. Shouldn't be too difficult. 11.9k. And the station. There's some of these ships are pulling back, which is good. Migration Treaty, let's accept that. And I kind of think that we do want to form an alliance. And there's already an alliance proposal. Do we make our allies? Do we make alliances? Do we need something like that? And how do we get it? And the station, it, it, it's shooting, it is shooting, but it's barely doing anything. And it's growing like crazy. Their growth speed is quite nice. Let's get the uh, research. And of course we're getting insulted. Like a good man said, you're insulting because you're losing the war. So, oh, look at all of these small ships. All of that, look at that shield go. It is just a death spawn. Uh, shields are a bit rough. And I know, right? That man was brilliant. Brilliant. Uh, we got a war declare here. Uh, not on us. Uh, it's most likely on him. He's rival. This is not the war.
Who are you going to fight? You're pathetic. I hate that we need the other button. Where is that? Where's the camera button? It's... Not this guy. It's this guy that I mean blow. Oh, that's nice. That is actually not too bad. Turn this one off. Let's turn you on. Let's turn you back off. Who are you fighting? It's the guy next to you, aren't you? Yeah, we'll, we'll definitely have to look into... The new order. Compreneur. The government agent responds to promoting the new order. It's an ideology in unprinted galactic empire. I like this one. We'll do this one later. Since naval capacity fleet command limit will be increased. The rivalry influence will be gained. Available envoys will increase. Is this the one that we need to make the uh, a federation? I think so. Don't think we can actually form a federation otherwise. And these guys are now at war so likely that is not happening. Let's take a look. Form an alliance. What does it say? Excellent relation. And it's actually decreased it. Let's form a defensive pack with them. Non-aggression pack. I would like it. Oh, because you're at war. I can't, can't select that. How about you? Can we reach you? So the likeliness of him assaulting um, this fellow over is quite large. Mm, you must be at peace. Okay, that's the biggest issue then. Okay, we'll deal with this. Uh, the other fleet, they will get here in time. Let's turn that one off because that is useless. There we go. He's now upgrading. And we'll immediately start sending you over there. We're building up the fleet. And we got one transport over here. So that's not the biggest just yet. One of my dogs is barking, which is always annoying. I'll have to check that. So give me a second. Okay, okay, I'm back. Sorry for that. Uh, my wife is currently sleeping, so dogs barking usually not the best idea. Uh, we need to make some rivals. Uh, I think we definitely need to rival him. So, make claims, harm relations. I think, yeah, we definitely need to have terrible relation. Uh, that will just happen over time. Eventually we'll get there. And he declared us rival, which is actually not too bad. It's this fellow over here, isn't it? So if he declared on me, I can declare on him. He's still equivalent. I want to deal with this fella actually quite early on. Because he will just get way too large, way too strong, and I do not want it. But equivalent means I will need three fleets to deal with that. And that is a bit much. But, all of that said, Naboo, we need to upgrade this. Upgraded. Definitely need to upgrade this. So keep that in mind. Will help me remember. We're now making 51 alloys, which is actually quite nice. And let's get you all the way over there. We took the... Uh, is this the mega structure? Let's take a look at the mega structures, actually. Is this their fleet building area? Where is it? Yeah, it's an orbital shipyard. <laughs> oh yeah, you are out of luck, my friend. You are out of luck. Not building ships over there. Just, it must hurt. So we actually did lose some ships. And that brings me to the following. We can actually repair the ships just, just over here. And just, just move over there. Let's go into... Fleet management. Who do we want to add in this one? Um, 
What kind of weapons did they have again? The assault ship. No, I think it is the uh, the anti the anti um, ship ship that I want. It's the escort. We'll add one. It's a small fleet. Actually, no. We'll add two. We'll decrease the cruisers and we will take on an early dreadnought. No. Mm. Let's do it like this. Just two of those. And we'll add some of the larger ships in a second. Uh, we can actually add a few more in these. So we might as well do so. Can we get that ship in there as well? We'll do two. And we'll add one more of those. It's precisely 130, which is not too bad. Let's do it like this. There we go. Uh, we can actually reinforce all of that, but we don't have the alloys for it. And there's no pop that's actually going to be doing it. Speaking of pop, uh, is that still a thing? Edicts and policies? Where's my food? Mm. Population control is allowed. That's funny. Trade policy. Right now, trade is just money. And we're making how much from trade? 133. We've got more than enough. Market of ideals will increase the amount of unity. Well, we already have quite a bit on that. A militarized... Oh, wow. That is quite good. Don't have to change that then. I don't see the um, the food ones. Unless they've changed the name and I'm an idiot and I'm not seeing it. Trade, droid workers are allowed... Refugees, citizen species only. Don't want to be, don't want to get all of them. Slavery, loud of course. Purging, sure, why not. Oppression, quite heavy. Uh, we have independent mining con uh, guilds who have not been con uh, contracted. What does this change? We'll mine spots in your empire, which means you don't need to build mining outposts. You must pay for their services. Uh... Interesting. That is really interesting. What's this one? Our intelligence officers may be instructed to shift their efforts away from localized canteens. More towards promising targets. Cool. Medical treatment. Our hospitals will, will use spice. Spice. Spices. So, rub some pepper on that wound and it will heal, I guess. This is allowed. This is bacteria, I guess that's good. Uh, let's contact this. Let's do that. Let's see what happens. I'm not sure what will happen though. Uh, let's move down here. We got this scientist. I'm sure that we have a bunch of things to do. Let's go to... Actually, it's F2. No entries yet. No anomalies? Damn. Man, they really don't like me. Uh, do we have automatic exploration yet? Yes, we do. Oh, the best. That's just the best. Can we... Okay, I think we can just build these... Over here. Let's build another science ship. While we deal with this wall. Have you been healing up? Almost. So we'll wait until it's healed. It looks like he's pretty much healed though. We're going to need maintenance after this. Don't bullshit me and just get it done. Technology secure. I think they're healed. We're going to need maintenance after this, but he's already healed up, so that is somewhat odd. Let's go over there. Uh while we have the fight here in I think this is their capital region. No, it's not, it's over here. So it's it's a bunch of stations we'll have to deal with, which is good, which we'll is vassalizes, do it, whatever. And we can get more energy called fusion reactors. Or more evasion. So do we need more power? No. Evasion is nice for your smaller ships. But let's go economy first. Because usually that's the one thing that will go down the drain with me. The fastest. Uh, 
industrialized hub is just an upgrade building we don't really need trust us speed innovation is really good but personally i like the strongholds because well this this fella is not going to last forever and by the looks of it the only entry point into my territory is this one so this territory this this space station is going to be the most important one that we currently have attacking enemy assets so next month we can actually build the station up there we go. Oh, there's a bit of lag, actually. Kind of hope that's not going to be too bad. Luckily, he's being reinforced. Oh, wow, he upgraded there in, in, I think. Did he upgrade or did he build these um, platforms? Let's take a look at that station, actually. Didn't do that. It doesn't look... That actually, there might be station or a platform we'll see it if the uh, if the number drops by about a thousand then yes there was a station doesn't look like usually it's the first thing that gets destroyed that's why i'm i'm not the you uh, the biggest fan of building platforms and we're gonna, we're gonna get a larger station with that i love that and it oh wow didn't know that i love that it actually flips on how it looks absolutely brilliant let's take that we can actually go for a perk so one vision empire sprawl from pops yeah. fy stages are tough i noticed i like that i really i think that's the best leader pool monthly credits plus 20 interesting the mining guilds monthly minerals plus 20 percent well, of course, we'll probably have to go for technology. And what I lacked in Star Trek New Horizons is there were different things going on. Institutions. Alloys. Alloys from jobs plus 15. That's so nice. Laser cells plus 7.5. Oh, damn. That's so good. Sensor range. Adaptable AI. Droid assembly speed plus 20. Droid leader. I should make droids, actually. I should. Just, it, it's that additional pop on your planet that just keeps doing stuff. Cloning technology. Pop growth speed plus 5. Uh, gene pools. Starfighter focus. <laughs> oh, yeah, baby. Mm, love it. Look at focus. Just getting more and more salty that I wasn't able to play this game earlier on. <laughs> <laughs> can you imagine well let's go for for the speed next up is going to be Kumpnor Kumpnor yeah I'm sure I'm pronounced that right love that so he's going over there did those stations increase as well so all of the stations actually increased interesting uh, luckily for us we can still do it do we need this data well I've seen what it does with Genesis, so I do want to actually go for it for once. At least my uh, my research has something to do. Uh, let's go computer program. I love these. Especially because you can actually focus on like your carrier ships. And that they will be carrier ships, which is amazingly good. Can we actually start... Let's see, drone assembly planned. And I'm going to take... The Liberty. Just building these everywhere. Uh, are these going to be your basic droids? Because if they are, I, don't, I might as well not build them over here on Coruscant. So these, these, these robots, are they going to be the basic of the base? Are these your mining droids? So I will build them over here then. I should, maybe I should read. You know, we got some tooltips here. Droid pops. Droid assembly. We'll just see once they get them. For now, we'll just make sure that we got all of them assembled on these planets. Um, we'll do the uh, the Coruscant uh, sector first. I do want to flip the governor. Speaking of governors. So, this one is negative uh, 25 on crime. Who else do we have? Administrative capacity. Food from jobs. Okay, so output. 
2572 on food food from jobs it is for you let's recruit you would like to see this flip so it's probably next one 72 help me remember uh plasma cell production plus five and we got the Clone Wars are over and the Galactic Empire emerged victorious. Emperor Palpatine is now focused on uh, the new Armada. Countless new ship designs have been created to suit his needs. While these new ships uh, will be much better than what we currently have, we can't throw away the old ships that saved us so many times. We have identified two vector class ships that can be used in the battle again after some repairs. Yes. Uh, we need a thousand alloys. Fine. We'll uh, we'll buy the thousand alloys, and this will get us more plasma. There we go. And they will serve as well. Get more ships. Why not? Why the hell not? Uh, we did lose some ships because we are inside of our Empire Sprawl right now. Three of them are being built. We need a bunch more. Uh, we actually took all of that. So, repair. I can feel there's a mosquito just crawling up my leg. Looking at that artery. Can't wait until he's actually found it. Okay, so... The station fell. That's good. Can we, can, thank you. Thank you, game. Thank you. Okay, let us... Go down here. Let's upgrade this starport. Uh, we'll take a look. So, we have a bunch of starports here. It's down there. Uh, we'll deal with those later. Uh, we did build him and him. So, he's going to be defensive for now. Let's get a star uh, fighter bay on there. And we're going to be downgrading you because we don't need you. Uh, you are going to be trade hop. Uh, we'll wait. So, there's a small ass fleet over there. It's just funny. Uh, are you going to be 7.2 as well? Um, almost repaired. We'll send you down here. I don't need his ships in my territory. That's the last thing I want. And there we go. Ships have been repaired. So we now got another fleet over here. Uh, which is... Uh, these are so good. Let's take a look. Yeah, the, the, the carriers are wonderful. So let's get started on the ship design here. I want to have your the escorts, two of them. Uh, I want the dreadnought as well as the assault ship. As well as I feel that we always need some frigates in there. So what's what's the difference again between these two? How the look? And this is more point defense. Kind of don't think that we need him. We could obsolete him. And just go for the early uh, frigates. But not having corvettes. It just feels wrong. Like the evasion is definitely higher on the corvettes. Uh, but it's very very poorly armored. Yeah I think I will obsolete him. The early corvette. Put out of service the early corvette. There you go. We'll make these into the new fleets. Uh, once the uh, the others just, just fall over, all over or die. We'll add those. So. Why are you still in here? Weird. No, actually, no. This is the right one. This is the right one. Let's get you in there. Let's do five. I think this is more than enough for one fleet. Although, it looks a bit wonky. Do it like this, 130. We'll build that up once we actually got the alloys for it, of course. Because, well, we're quite short on alloys right now. Uh, we'll focus on this for some more. So, we got some... 
transport fleets over there. Uh, this one is still lacking too. Are you healed up? Okay, let's go deal with that. 